Ladies and gentlemen, welcome to Punk Rock Review, home of a bunch of opinionated crap you don't care about, also the home of the feedback you provide that we don't care about, keeps us on an even playing field, and we like that. Real quick shout out to our sponsor, this one comes in from Brittany. Hey, I just want to let you know that these still all suck. So keep sucking, and I guess just keep making all this suck that sucks a bunch of suck suck. Suck 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 suck. Alright, cool, thanks for the money. Anyhow, moving straight into it today, today we're going to be talking about a show that's been around for uh, not all too long. It's actually kind of uh, newish on the, uh, you know, ever-evolving and changing uh, streaming platforms uh, known as one of the streaming platforms. That's right. Today we're talking about Good Omens from Amazon Prime. So, all in all, what can be said about Good Omens on Amazon Prime? Well... The first five minutes had us extremely, extremely worried, thinking, uh, you know, oh, this is going to be just a giant pile of uh, something we don't want to watch. But, but, it does pull it off, uh, you know, at the, uh, you know, end of a couple of parts uh, that just makes it really, really worthwhile uh, to kind of check out and watch. Uh, you know, it really kind of, uh, finds itself and comes up with some, uh, you know, real clever kind of ideas, uh, you know, and concepts and things like that, uh, that kind of rounded out. So, you know, we were worried at first, uh, but it does pick up and kind of turn itself around and get to be a, uh, you know, rather enjoyable show, uh, you know, with some good, uh, little story arcs and things of that nature. And then, uh, you know, it definitely... Definitely, you know, it's a great concept and idea, uh, hands down. So, you know, if you're into any of, like, the, you know, kind of thinking of uh, angels and demons or anything like that, uh, you should get a rather good enjoyment out of this, uh, with the exception of one or two parts that are like, eh, really? But the great concept and idea is uh, super minimum, uh, you know, on, like, uh, F this show moments where you would want to turn it off and not watch it, so... The writing's clever, keeps it rocking and rolling, so it's worth checking out, or not, maybe you don't like, uh, you know, supernatural type, uh, you know, shows, then it's not for you. So stick with Golden Girls, Ma, we're telling you, but you might like this one, so maybe check it out. Good Omens, Amazon Prime, what do we think of you? Uh, you get a, uh, good old-fashioned PG, because you're pretty good. And Amazon, keep it up on some of these uh, original programming, uh, you know, shows and things of that nature. Because, you know, instead of porting stuff over that's made in other regions and areas, like some other streaming services do, and claim they're all new and great, Netflix, uh, you know, yeah, keep coming up with the original programming and increasing the quality of the programming you have. And, uh, you know, yeah, you definitely are forced to be reckoned with. So... Anyhow, good omens. There you go. Got a PG for pretty good. So go watch it. Or don't. Why are you watching this? Three minutes of your life gone. You're welcome. Have a good one. You probably didn't. We'll catch you next time. Probably won't.